Okay, and we're back uh, for the second shape. Uh, in the previous episode, we uh, we discussed the the first shape of the minor pentatonic scale, which is uh, which goes like this. And now we're going to the second shape. Uh, and again, the tabs are in the description below, um, which is like this. If you uh, if you watch very carefully, you'll see that the 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 let's say the lowest note on each string is the same as every note uh, every highest note from the previous uh, shape. So um, if you go like this, it's this one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. So. Basically, you just have to remember the other ones. So it's just going to be two up from that, and two up from the other one, two up from that one, and then three up from this one, three up from that one, and two up from that one. So if you memorize it like that, maybe it's easier. Maybe it, maybe it doesn't work for you, but for me it does. Um, uh, just. It, it's it's interlinked, you know. It's it's not something you can you can see on itself. It's 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 got to do something. It, it, it's, it has something to do with with each other. So and then um, right now I'm playing it with my pinky finger and then my middle finger. Um, you don't always want to do that because. Uh, your pinky finger is not the strongest finger, so if you want to do some bends, uh, you, you're gonna have to use your other fingers. I mean, it, it's definitely doable with your pink, but but I mean, it's it's not nice. So um, you might want to practice it doing like doing it like this, and you might even want to do these ones. Why do you even want to do those with uh, your ring finger um, or third finger, however you want to call it? So um, anyway, uh, we got two shapes now, and and in the next video we're going to discuss the third shape. But make sure you already know these two by heart before you go to the next video. Because um, if you want to learn it all at once, it's it's really um, it's really difficult to put it to practice. But right now, you can already start playing some licks, like or maybe. And if you're really good at bending or something, you might you might already go like. Which is all pentatonic, uh, minor pentatonic. Now I'm cheating here because this is this is actually a blues note. But anyway, it's it's the same kind of it's the same kind of deal. It's just uh, just experiment with it. Just try to play something and make it fun for yourself. And uh, do it in in in, in both the the uh, both the scales or the uh, how do you call those uh, the positions. So uh, yeah, uh, have fun and practice hard, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.